Good day folks, here's my new cell. I let it dry overnight and it's working very well. It's a cell stack and it's put in around 11.5 volts. And I've got the meter on there, it flickers a little bit here. 11.48 and same thing as others have noted and myself, a couple milliamps of output. But the thing here is um, as you start bringing up the potential it becomes more powerful. So. Uh, you can start doing more with it, like charge capacitors faster at higher voltages and whatnot. And of course, small things like these LEDs here will run natively without any step up or anything like that. If we can just, uh, if I can flick it there with my hand, I only have one hand, bear with me. I'll try and put that in there. Easier, um, I should have had a uh, clip for this actually. I didn't think it was going to be a big deal. There we go. Okay, so here's the light. This is the LED. If I can keep it on there. Okay. Because it's just sitting on there. It's not a really good contact. But you know, it holds the voltage at 2.5 with the LED loading it. So this is, as you can see, pretty bright for. Um, just like that. So I used the um, solid state, uh, the PEG electrolyte with a bit of copper oxide mixed in there. Look what it's doing, it's jumping all of a sudden to 10.74 but the LED is still on there. It's going really bright now. So it, anomalies here and there with these cells. Under a load they start acting kind of flunky sometimes. They self regage as you can see, and sometimes loading it makes them um, charge up more on their own, as you can see what it's doing there. Which is very unusual behavior, but look how that LED is, is it's almost like it's gonna um, burn out soon. So very, very cool stuff here. And I want to show you all folks, it's just the meter is connected. And that's what it's doing under a load. Very interesting self regaging capabilities here. Just zooming out here. It's pretty light out here, so. But still, there with the light, it's pretty uh, bright. So just keeping you folks up to date with all of this and I hope you enjoy